Commissioned by the Emperor Justinian in the early 6th century, the Byzantine Basilica was the greatest architectural achievement of the early Christian church. When the Ottoman Turks conquered Constantinople in 1453, instead of demolishing the Hagia Sophia, they converted it into a mosque. But there was no escaping the fact that this conversion was superficial. Islamic elements had merely been bolted onto a church. Somehow, Christianity was always showing through. There came a time when this partial makeover wasn't good enough, not at any rate for the greatest of the Ottoman rulers, Suleiman the Magnificent. So when he decided to build a new mosque unencumbered by Christian leftovers, he was making a point for Allah. And he was making it directly at his rivals, the Holy Roman Emperor and the Pope. Ironically, the master builder ordered to create the great Friday service mosque had been born a Christian. Mima Sinan was a Janissary converted to Islam as a child and conscripted into the crack household troops of the Sultan. Suleiman's order was thrilling but daunting. A great dome surrounded by half domes, four minarets, a structure as immense as the two continent empire, a mosque that would eclipse Hagia Sophia. The visible proclamation of Islam's victory. Sinan's great idea is the indivisibility of space, the architectural proclamation of the union of all believers. Here, the space isn't chopped up by forests of columns and barriers of choir and altar. Here, we are all in it together. Islam is a religion of law and simple faith. Everything revealed to all. Islam means submission. And what we submit to here is the light, the light of true faith and of the Quran, its record, the light of God's law streaming through 249 windows, drowning the space with radiance. How weightless this all feels, even the gigantic dome. And that's all the more extraordinary because it could only be supported by absolutely titanic architecture, these huge four masonry piers. Everything is kind of airy and light and graceful, but you feel behind it is this hard mathematical engineering mind of Sinan. That achievement, something built on the ground that is full of this kind of planetary uplift towards which our gaze is sent over and over again, is what makes this place one of the most beautiful buildings on Earth.